Yeah, that's definitely Cantonese. That's not Mandarin. I can tell the difference already. In the meantime, I have to just wait. Um, this is what happens when you have to um, take care of your hair every so often. Whatever it is. I would like to color my hair like purplish or reddish. That's for next time though. Right now, I just want to deal with the basic things. And I'm kind of tired. I went to the gym earlier. Freaking tired. It's definitely not Spanish. <laughs> So um afterwards I'll be going to like Newark. Um there's like a samba thing going on right now. Well not right now but like later on. And I'm going to see if I can participate or just watch. We shall see. Why not? Um I'm just waiting and see what happens. Take it each breath at a time. Right? <laughs> There's some ears here. Flares. <laughs> um, what else should I say? Um, there's a lot of stuff to do prior to going to Newark. Um, I'll go with a friend. I gotta get my car fixed. Yeah. There's so much. There's so many things I have to do this week. It's crazy, and it's already December. And um, it, it's, it's really good. It's meaningful. It's gonna be very meaningful. Um, you know, I just gotta focus on things I need to do. But anyways, um, let's see. I have to have so much patience with everything's in line. Everything's in line. Yeah. There's nothing interesting on TV. So what I'm doing this is a, this is a live I upload of uh, YouTube and I show. I don't know if you guys can hear me, but it's a live update, uh, upload of um, YouTube and see if it works. They're being so freaking loud. They're being so freaking loud. They am. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> You know, I can totally see myself also. Um, one of the places that I've always wanted to uh, visit is China, and it's just totally different. And it's different than America. It's different than the Western world. So to me, um, I like different things. And I was thinking and reflecting upon that. I'm like, yeah, totally. I could totally do another culture that is not Latino. Um, but definitely, I can sometimes I just vision myself like, yeah, I would like to be in China just to like experience what that means or what that is. And just to be there, just to see what it is about, you know? 
I don't want to sound pessimistic, but like, you know, we all freaking die. And it is those times when, when, it, when we are at our best deathbed that we start thinking like, oh my God, you know, that's something I should have done. I definitely don't want to have regrets. And that's why I try to live my life all the guys best. I don't want to live my life so like, you know, what if, what if, what if. I just want to do it, that's it. Oh man, he's fast. That's American. Mego, Mego, Ren, football. So, that's cool. I really like it. You know, and one of the things that I started incorporating in my uh, daily living is consuming uh, hot water. Every day, I consume hot water. And the first thing that, because I learned from the Chinese, um, it's a huge thing that they do throughout the day. It's warm water, and apparently that also helps with the menstruation when you have your menstruation and uh, other stuff. But there's some secrets that I want to practice. Um, so hopefully we'll see what happens. So so far, I guess it's good. Um, there's so much natural stuff that I want to do, but it's one step at a time. The hot water thing is amazing. My neighbors, they're Chinese, and they do that every day. Okay, your grandma, the grandpa, I mean, the bigger sister, the auntie, everybody. So anyways, I'm just waiting, see what happens.